Hey, 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 Today we got Kev on TMZ. We got Tesla Robots. We got J. Cole releases a song. I wouldn't say strikes back, but he releases a song. He, he addresses the situation. Addresses the situation. He's part of the song. Uh, yeah, we got Young Philly charged with very serious crimes in Australia. Yeah, great. Uh, and that's probably all we'll be able to cover on the bonus. Maybe Beyonce, uh, Pierce Morgan, and Jaguar, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Uh, if we have time. Um, so let's hop in. Jump in. Jump in. Jump out. Turn yourself about. I said jump in. Jump out. Introduce yourself. My name is Kevin. Yeah. I'm Kevin. Yeah. People call me Kevin. Yeah. Because my name is Kevin. Roll. Yeah. <laughs> so if you've been following me this week, I started my campaign, mm -hmm. uh, my cameo campaign. Yes. Uh, brilliant work, people are saying. People are saying it. I'm not saying it. Mm, everybody's I, saying it. I'm saying it's highly effective. Yeah. As a person who watches the numbers, it's high, way higher than posting a flyer or just saying, come to my tour. Way higher, more effective. What made you come up with this idea? I'm going to tell you what it is mm -hmm. and what it was. Tell us what it is, Kevin, what it was. One, you can't do flyers. Okay. The show hasn't happened. I got to get to the first weekend of the show when Josh can do the real. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Then people are like, oh, oh Kev's on tour. Mm -hmm. Right. But in order to get there, you gotta you gotta go awareness place. Mm -hmm. Okay, you gotta let them know you're even on tour, mm -hmm. right? So I said, how can I get people to watch this video of me talking about a tour? There's nothing really exciting. I don't want to give away the jokes yet. Mm -hmm. So I said, I'll purchase some cameos. Uh, have celebrities of all different types. Your brain just jumped over there. I on it, and this is no hyperbole, it's so no specific. joke. I think God jumps and drops ideas in I, my head. I agree. I literally don't. I, the idea was just like, get some celebrities to do it because people recognize a celebrity. They're more likely to stop and listen no matter what. Uh -huh. No matter what they say. If they, it's a face they recognize and it's on my page. They're going to be like, what is Kev up to? Right. Right. In general, people will just be like, what is this? All you need, I just need to hold you for three seconds. Mm -hmm. If I can hold you for three seconds, uh, you're more likely to do it. And then what I didn't anticipate was how many people see Kev on stage and pronounce anything other than that. You didn't know that? No. There are people who are fans of you that still cannot say your name. They say Kevon. Kevon. Oh, I and love that Kevin on stage. Boy, when I tell you. So Redman was the perfect drop one because he said everything but he was the most Redman. And then it was like, so now after a couple, it was like, how is Kevin doing this? By now, people know what Cameo is. They understand that I paid for them. And, and thank you, because people started uh, purchasing more and more Cameos of mine. I said, why am I getting really? so many Cameo requests? I said, because of Kevin's tour. Thank you. Wow. That's <laughs> so, good. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So I, and now people are like, who is he going to have next? I probably will run out before the end of this week. I'm bored of it now. I get bored very easily. Oh, uh, the way you move on is is should be studied. That's, we're out. Listen, this is why we're ecstatic. Here's the thing, still here. Yeah, we listen, know every week. Bored, but I also don't mind guilting you. Oh God, I'll bring these kids here. <laughs> Am are you hungry? Well, <laughs> Uncle Kevin done cancel the show. He got more. See what's the left in the cupboard. More gruel for you. <laughs> but go ahead. So yesterday, I'm um I'm actually at the church. Uh, about to leave. About to leave the church. We just shot like six promo videos that I was gonna parse out week to week. And that's actually all the cameo was, was supposed to buy me some time mm -hmm. until um, this week. Mm -hmm. And then I was gonna release one of these a week until Thanksgiving and then whatever, whatever. Mel texted me in our uh, family group chat and was like, Kev, why are you on TMZ? And I was like, what? Picture of Ice-T, link to Ice-T. And I'm like, oh, she's like, somebody's being funny. Like somebody made a thing. I clicked that dog on link. I said, oh wait, no, this really, Wait, why is, okay, maybe there's some mistake. It was the most, it had to be nothing going on in Team Z to, that day. No, no, no. Stuff could have been going on. No. This is interesting. I, that was the one, when you showed me the list, he was one of the people that I was most excited about because it feels, 
even more random than a Kenny G. You think so? Kenny G seemed way off. And I couldn't believe Kenny G played the he sax. He played the sax. I said, oh, man. Kenny G. He gave me that. Man, I was like, I never, I thought he might hold it. I never thought he oh, would man, play. You know what you know what people were hitting him for? Hey, yeah, that's I true. Know. You it's know what you mean. Uh, what's his face? <laughs> Oh yeah, friend? yeah. You better the boo boo if I gave you this money, nigga. I don't need to hear your talking voice. But yeah, so the TMZ article just recapped it. Like I, I see what he said. He was like, "Yeah, hey, I'm in the Bahamas." I think they said Hurricane Helene, which I don't. I think it's Milton. Milton, I think. Yeah, I think Helene was a couple weeks ago, the one that uh, did a lot of damage to Asheville. Yeah. But you know who listens to TMZ for correct reporting? <laughs> uh, so. The fact, and they posted it on TMZ. They tweeted it. They put it on Instagram. The article has the flyer in it. Yeah. And Is I it said, really? yes. Oh, that promotion. You can't, I said, you can't you, buy that. You can't plan that. You can't plan. And I, if I could, I would. But you, I could not have said I got to get away to get on TMZ. I would have thought it had to be something like, you know, scandalous. Not just he kept going on tour in these churches, but Listen. who wouldn't serve a God like this? Mm-hmm. I said in my video today, I thank God I'm on TMZ for, for what I do, not what I've done. Okay, come on. Come You're popcorning, kid. Yeah, you are. Popcorn. Mm, a popcorn. Popcorn, popcorn, popcorn. Yeah! You popcorn, good. Uh, what celebrity would you... Have loved to have been on cameo that I paid for. Or just that, that ain't one there that you wish if they would. Oh, that on. ain't. Yeah, man. Well, I'll tell you one that what that I paid for, but they didn't do it. Soldier boy. Oh, Soldier boy I... had a parentheses big Draco, and you I tell just got, I just got the thing and said big Draco couldn't do yours in time. I said, oh, big Draco. Mm, big Draco. I would have loved the big Draco. Go on, he be on TikTok doing lives. Get on his live. <laughs> hey, big Draco. Get on stage. What you think about talking to me? Uh, was Ray J on there? Ray J was on there. Oh, I would have went for Ray J tough. Oh, yeah. I would have been like, break the glasses. Mm-hmm. Uh, man, because to me, the more random, the more successful. Not mm-hmm. like famous. Mm-hmm. Random is doing much better than like famous. Oh, good. Solid That's a good pause. Crack. Jesus. Uh, who is somebody that I we would be like? Promo. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. The other one that I wanted, I know that's not what you ask. The Undertaker ain't on cameo no more, but he was doing his in full wrestling gear. Oh yeah, you would have, you wouldn't have cared about the tour. You just would have been happy that he, he said was Kevin Stage. <laughs> Probably The Rock. The, uh, if I got somebody like The Rock, because he could cut a promo. Sold out if you got The Rock, man, he could cut a promo. Uh, uh, Stanley from the office, he owed me that bread. <laughs> I would love to get Stanley. I There's would, a lot of people from the office. I know. I asked them. Oh, they didn't. They didn't see it. I think Dolly Parton would be a great random. Dolly Parton would be great. That would be yeah. good. That would be a great random. That would be so good. Kev on stage. <laughs> I, I Kev on stage. Well, Joe Louine won't be at your show. If if she won't be there, I might be. Blacks <laughs> love Dolly. Yeah. They love that old Dolly Parton's. She's been a good time. She's been a good time. All right, let's move on. Moving on. Uh, Tesla. Actually, that's not what we had next. Hold on. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. 